Welcome to Project Wrongway. I'm Ben. Rachel's not in the episode today because she didn't do her makeup and she doesn't feel like she likes the way she looks. I like the way she looks, even without makeup. Hear that, other guys' wives? That's the kind of husband I am. You also want to shove me in front of the camera when I don't want to be in front of the camera. I do. I want to put you on display. Okay. Up on a pedestal. So we need a talk So about high that I could almost see eternity. <laughs> That's a song. <laughs> I don't recognize it. I don't know music. You put me upon a pedestal. No. So high that I could almost see eternity. Where is that from? You needed me. I don't recognize it. You needed me. Speaking of needs. What is that? Project Wrongway has shirts, everybody. My homeboy at Ace Overland. Behold above my left nipple. Now back up again. Got it? Yeah? Good? This is a 2XL because I'm what my wife likes to call husky. Shut up! I'm just as husky! So if you're six foot, give or take, and about 235 pounds, and you're one burrito away from 245 pounds, <laughs> Go for the 2XL. I'm going to put a link, though, in the beginning of this episode. Please go check out the shirts and stickers. But if you ever wanted a Project Wrongway shirt, they're, they're there for you. So the pre-orders are in. Get them while they're hot. Before they're hot, because this is a pre-order. Get them before they're hot. There you go. I know a lot of people have been thinking the shirts are like an imaginary thing. They're like they're never going to happen. I or they just, like, they don't exist, like Bigfoot. Or Charles Barkley. So last episode we got like 3,000 views in the first two days. What's that all about? It's like way more than normal, right? Yeah, we're not, uh, we're not that good. We're not that good. <laughs> so our theory is, is that the reason we got more views is because we had dolphin in the title. So people were searching for like cute animals. Dolphin videos, videos and they found my show. <laughs> and they found our They watched 22 <laughs> seconds of it and realized it had nothing to do with dolphins. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to try to include other animals in yes. the episodes. Yes. What animal are we doing today? Dogs. Dogs. And their incredible style. What? I'll let you put that one together. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Part the seats. I'm still waiting on a few parts for the engine. And we're going to dive in there and swim. With the dolphins? With the dolphins. <laughs> Ooh, that's a hornet's nest right there. Where? Ah! Don't flick it at me! <laughs> well, there's like, there's nine of them in there. Nine? There's nine different hornet's nests. <gasps> there are! Okay. Today I'm going to take apart the seats and prepare the frames and other bits of them for sandblasting. Did I mention that we have shirts available? Yeah, you did. <laughs> what color are they? They're black and blue. Black and blue! Like a child molester's testicles in oh, prison. Okay, there you go. I wasn't, I wasn't sure where you were going with that. Yeah. It's like, whoa. Where I hope Bag it it's off. because he's been beaten to death. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know much about taking apart the seats. But you don't. Shocker. What we do make up for with lack of knowledge is a sense of childlike wonder. I've got two seats and one cup. I actually brought multiple cups. I'm going to put the hardware from this seat into this cup and I'm going to save it and not lose it like I've done with every other bit of hardware I've used. First, we're going to go simple. I'm going to unscrew this backing plate. So These screws have uh, little bits of dirt in them. So I'm going to use my Milliwalk A, which is Algonquin for the good land. What are you looking at me like I'm about to say something racist? Milwaukee? Milli Milwaukee, but it's actually Milliwalk A which is Algonquin for the good land. Are you sure? Yeah, ask Alice Cooper, he knows. Alice Cooper, the singer? Yeah. Why would he know? So I'm just gonna get in there and what I'm doing is cleaning up the threads. I wish you were in this. Your chest looks nice in that sweater. I think we Do could affect- you want affect, me to clean up I th the threads? I think we could call those sweater what we in the business you? say Sweater kittens. Now we're just cleaning up the area where the screws live. All these parts are going to be transported to a powder coater. It's going to be great. 
I'm actually glad to be documenting this episode because this way I can remember how to put a seat back together, you know? Mm -hmm. I don't know why I'm starting with... Oh, no, 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 no. I don't know why I'm... No, no, I got it, I got it. Yeah. I don't know why I'm starting with the backing plate, though. Please. No! <laughs> Just one of them? It's no big deal. I'm going to get in there real quick. Looks like you need to clean it out. Again. Yeah, I'm going to try to clean it out again. It's always the last... in the mirror. No, I wasn't. <laughs> I know how trashy I look. I know today. there aren't any mirrors around. Ooh, there's things living in here. I don't think they're alive anymore. Well, they they were living in it. Why am I saving the hardware though? Yeah, well, why are you? Well, that's the thing. Why am I saving the hardware? Is there a way to just buy new hardware? <clears throat> well, I'm taking this. Huh. Hope everybody saw me just repair that with my bare hands. You're really strong. I'm a wizard, honey. This is weird. What is that, do you think, in there? That plastic. Um, headrest. Are there holes for a headrest? There aren't any holes in this. Well, maybe there used to be. And they just covered it. A lot of cowards would use gloves right now. Maybe you should maybe wear gloves? Nope. Okay. You want to feel the metal on your hands, honey. You want to know when you're making... Slippery gecko. <laughs> yeah, you would be the one. Yeah, there's just a lot of bugs. A lot of bugs. Are you doing this outside the shop? No, no. Inside the shop is best. That's the only way to contain a swarm of wild bees. Is this the chair that came with it, or is this something that came with the other one? So, that's a terrific point. I noticed that both the chairs. I thought we're the same, but they're a little bit different. It means nothing. I'm pausing for effect. No, but I mean, what What do you mean both the chairs? You These are two front chairs. This one came when I bought my Land Cruiser. That one came with this one. This one came with the investment. This one came with Vesta. And okay. So is this the one that's going into this one? Yes. Okay. This bench. So that and this. Just remember, I took this screw. I'm not going to remember any of it. No, the video is going to remember, oh. honey. <laughs> Silly goose. Oh, man. Smooth. Smooth. Now, those parts fell apart before I could remember where they went. Dang it. That's okay. The internet will tell me. Yeah. Get your shoes. Well, we told you about a million times. Please put your shoes on when you're outside. But you just want to come back. Get out of here, Wayne. When you get out of here, God, now get. <laughs> Love you. This is really no. I need my dikes. 
I said no when you Honey, outside. please! You need dikes? You know... Aren't those things that have to do with water? <laughs> dikes are... When two women love each other. Well, there's that, but then isn't it also a water thing? Motorcycles. These are dikes. There's, so there's many kinds of dikes. These are Nipex dikes. So are they going to put new coils in or are they going to use those? We're going to use the old ones. Those look like pretty rinkety, non-supportive. What are you talking about? Coils. They look fine. Sure. Let me just cut this giant asbestos piece off here. <laughs> I don't know if it's made of asbestos or not. Little rings. In medieval times, they would link these rings together to make chain mail. And then later they found out they were useful in doing upholstery for automobiles. <laughs> Boy, this is uh, gonna be great. People are gonna love this. Get. Dyke eating a ring. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to do with that headrest. Well, so I'm gonna have to get in touch with my upholstery guy and ask him like, what in the hell to do? It's never, you know, well, Ben, what did you expect when you're taking this seat apart? You know? And the other part of me is like, Ben, who are you talking to? It's just you. Yeah, honey, they're going to put it back together. Couldn't you have technically just given him the whole chair and you would have fixed it? No, because that's... No, I was going to... I got to take the seats apart and get them powder coated, the frames, so that when he reassembles the seats themselves, I can, uh... Okay, well, maybe instead of just staring at that longingly and sadly and confusedly, you just move on and strip that one. And then how do, off you, how do you know how I'm staring at something? I can see it in your eyes. You, you the, can feel the depression I can moving see in. It huh? in <laughs> now, this was going to be a good weekend, and it's not going to be now. This is the mechanism move the seat forward to move back. the seat forward and back. Okay, so that's important because yeah. I won't be able to drive it if that's broken. Okay. Let's be honest. I'm gonna lose that. Don't do that. Seats suck. Like I'm struggling right now with some of the concepts. Of like, I don't know. See how like the springs are falling apart and brittle. I don't know if that for an upholstery guy is like an easy fix. Like, oh yeah, it'll take five seconds. I'm sure he could probably put new. Or yeah, or is it like a thing where they put new springs in? That's what I'm saying. Just tear it all apart and then call the guy and be like, hey, do you need these on there? Or can you put them on there? That's what I'm saying. So do what you can do and then call them and ask your questions. Boy, these mechanics workwear gloves Amazing. are so grippy right now. to know what my face looks like on the toilet. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Ew, is that a live one coming out of it? A larva? Is it? Is that alive? It kind of looks like it might be alive. Is it moving? Okay, next. Ah, why is this by me? <laughs> Did you let stupid wasps go, honey? You kicked it. Well, you threw it at me. Why did you throw it by me? I thought you were filming them. Notice where these springs are. So we got this. Amazing. Amazing. Okay, we got this spring right here. Just uh -huh. at that round hole. You can't see any hole because of your oh, the little round hole. Okay. Not the square hole, the round hole. Okay, round this spring. <laughs> The spring is underneath. The flashing. This is flap. The lippity flap. Alright, whatever. I might need to do something new with this. Oh gosh. Let go, you stupid dumb bastard. Stop! Don't fight me! Use two hands. No. There we go. With the helicopter. Easy does it. Boom. Seat repair. Okay, so there's a washer, a lock washer.
regular washer? Lower. Science. There you go. Washer science. And then there's a plastic bushing type washer underneath. Oh gosh, this is so boring. Why do upholstery people do this for a living? <coughs> Another bathroom shot there. One more time. Melt it. Melt it power. Okay, I thought that would come on. It did not. That's gonna get powder coated too. Something tells me exact same. Exact same amount of bits here. So wash nut. And then we have lock washer. Followed lower, by wash. Lower. Here you go. Nut, lock washer, washer, and then underneath is this plastic Delrin washer. So if I go slow. It works? Yeah. Well, we know. When you it. rush it. A lot of things work better when you go slow. Mm-hmm. Yes. That seems like a good plan. Don't you have like loosening, deepening stuff? I don't know why I'm using that giant <laughs> extension. Oh, this bolt's from the other side. That's welded in there. So how the hell? Oh. I'm not going to listen. You have to cut it then. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Ow. How's that attached? These should slide out, right? Yeah. Should slide out. This should slide out. I'm just gonna go get a hammer. I'll just put some lube in there. I'm gonna get a hammer too. Oh gosh, I've been sitting for too long. This is a fool's errand, honey. These seats are in too bad a shape. What am I doing? I don't know. What the hell is my hammer? Oh, I know where it is. Is that the house? No. It's right here. <laughs> it's right here, honey. Hey, just a gentle. <laughs> it's not the direction I want to go though. Okay, by the sound of that, it's not moving. I've reached a, like an impasse. I am terrible at upholstery. Have you looked up that piece and like what it's supposed to do? And maybe it's supposed to stay on. I love the smell of that stuff. No. Yeah, but I'm just I'm working the grease in. Out of my way. You're so rude. What is that? A 13? Look at you. What? What? Okay. That just looks super stripped. Son of a bitch. Can you, did you buy a tool that's supposed to fix that stuff? No, it doesn't put threads on, honey. It just. What the hell? What's the deal? There's like a. There's gotta be like a stop. There's like a stop in. Hold on, hold on, hold on, stop. No, whatever. Shit. No, move on, come back to it. Before I can turn these seats in to get them powder coated, I gotta cut this bolt out and weld in a new bolt right here. Possibly more than one. I genuinely thought I would come down here, quickly disassemble the seat, <coughs> and uh, I mean, we'd be smashing by now. Now I'm just getting super depressed because I just drenched in failure. <clears throat> and I'm like, you know, when you take something apart and you just discover. I'm starting to not care. This is what happens. I start taking stuff apart and I'm like, you know what, screw this. I don't need this crap. <laughs> anyway, it's okay. There's a little intricate part. So I'm gonna want you to get in close on this. The seat release. Okay. Yeah, there's there's no a spring. Hell, this is gonna put this spring hook thing. 
See? The spring's on this side of the bolt. It's like it's wrapped around the bolt, sweetheart. But yeah, it's wrapped around the bolt. Can you stop moving here? There you go. There it is. This seat hook thingy wasn't on the seat that came with mine. Hmm. So I was thinking, oh, I could just use the parts from mine. That's not going to be the case. You install the spring and everything first, loose, and then you put this latch on there and you're back in business. Okay. I don't remember the exact position of this latch, but I know it's going to get powder coated. Boom, in the powder coated pile. I'll tell you, in this position, my parts are just squeezed into a tiny little compartment. They're a lot bigger, but obviously it doesn't seem that way because of the way I'm sitting. Gently tear back the signs of time. Do I powder coat the springs? Or do you just leave them alone? Do you spray them with oil or something, you know? Or it's a culture for the springs. No, there's no, there's no way they just make springs. Am I not giving upholstery people enough credit? I think you aren't. Okay, I know they're making the foam. Like I've, my upholstery buddy is doing the foam. Okay, okay, let's get Getting that embarrassing sweat just under my tits. <laughs> I, get that. I get that too. Right underneath my tits. It's okay. So I can see sandblasting this, just painting everything. But these, these look like they're okay. These springs. Question number one. Do these come apart? Should I know how that works? Is it something obvious? Seat rails. Question two. One of these springs in the backrest is broken. It was broken right here and I've lost the piece can't weld it or shit. I don't know what you do. So one of these squiggly long springs and clamps is broken. Do, do upholstery guys fix that? Or do, do I fix that? Can I fix that? Is Charles Barkley a real person? Those are my two questions. <laughs> so that's taken apart the front driver's seat of the 7172 front bench seat of the Toyota Land Cruiser FJ40 model. You don't need to see me take apart the rest, so I'm not gonna show that. I don't think that's necessary. I'm gonna bag up this upholstery and throw it in the garbage. All right, next time I'll do the work. All right. Love you. I love you. Viewers. Love I love you, viewers. And dolphins. Having dolphins. I know. I'm low on dolphins. I love supply them. <laughs> no, don't do that.